Nice little no look over his shoulder pass inside to Dom. Good finish. Pickett last year in the Highlanders win over UC Riverside, one of three games these teams played. Pickett went for 22 points in the UC Riverside win, had six three-pointers in that game. Velp held scoreless so far. Good position against Mormon, and he's able to get Velp a very good free throw shooter at 83%. Ford stripped. Langston Redfield getting his right hand in there. Andrew Dugalay working against Matting. Back out, Velp, and it's going to be a block. December 19th. Colin Velp, a chance to get UCI back on the scoreboard for the front slate for UC Irvine. They won four of their first five as well. Had Back comes DJ Davis. He's open. And tipped back in, Colin or not. Two-point lead for UC Riverside. Haven't seen Callum McCray since the opening moments of this half. Velp, great spin move, finishes Islanders. Tie ball game. Velp looking to go back to work. The fadeaway is good. Backing down McCray, spinning. Too strong, but Velp able to get the offensive rebound because he's got Zion pulling on him. Now looking to go against Pullen. Trying to stand his ground. Another fadeaway. And that one goes down. And if you're UCI, put the pedals to the metal. See if you can get a basket here. Get a stop. Increase this lead. Redfield over to Lee. They isolate Velp again on the left side. This time Matting on him goes right by him. And then the quick first step by Matting. Velp was named to the Lou Henson Player of the Year watch list. That's given each year to the top mid major And Velp going over to challenge him. JP threw that down, so you knew there was no challenge coming. A much-needed easy bucket for UC Riverside. Lobbing inside, it was tipped, but Johnson controls. Velp going right at Mormon. Count the five tonight. And now has 18. A one of two trip for Pullen, making an eight point ball game. Riverside trying to trap. Butler, Velp open, easy two. Little game to UC Santa Barbara last season. They beat UC Riverside in the semifinals to get to that title game in Vegas back in March. Yeah, they look good. By the way, at the other end, Zion pulling. That's another missed front end one and one for UC Riverside. Flynn Cameron back in the ball game. And Felt pulls down the rebound despite Matting nearly tipping it away. Three pointers not falling. For UC Riverside, they're now one for their last eight from deep. Yeah, with the three-pointers not falling, they just can't do anything on the offensive set. As you mentioned earlier, uh, Eater's not really respecting that shot, so they're playing tough inside. Velp, another fall away, and another. And only his fourth rebound, but he's been a force underneath for the Anteaters. UC Riverside continuing to shoot the three ball poorly. Now just under 18% as Velp goes at 16 points now. Mormon's got four fouls. See if Velp goes right at him here. Another turnaround, and that one goes down as Pickett. Goes to Tattersall, just stepped in front off the sideline. And with that missed three, this will be the worst three-point shooting game of the season for UC Riverside. Just at 15%. For a one and one. Probably not going to get to his career high that And that free.
from deep. Yeah, with the three-pointers not falling, they just can't do anything on the offensive set, as you mentioned earlier. Uh, Eater's not really respecting that shot, so they're playing tough inside. Velp, another fall away, and another.